Hey, YouTube. Seem to have a few people that don't quite understand certain things like the dictionary definition of a pedophile, the medical text of a pedophile. I just want to take the time to go through some of these and read them for those that don't seem to have that ability. Definitions of a pedophile on the web. Now this is just a simple Google search, the first one I come to. A person who prefers sex with children usually visualizing his or herself as being the same magical age as the child. Just for starters, it sounds like it was written by a pedophile. Magical age. This, oh, the North American Freedom Foundation. Behavioral modification, bestiality. Okay, let's go down and see what they say about pedophiles. Person who prefers sex with children, usually visually, blah, blah, we already went through that. Most pedophiles are convinced that there is nothing wrong with them having sex with children. These individuals usually believe that laws forbidding adult sexual interaction with children, possibly including their own, are unfair and unjust. Some insist that having sex with children is an expression of their love for children. Ah, uh, bullshit! Okay, let's go back here and see what somebody else has to say. Well, let's try Wikipedia. Wikipedia. Oh, okay, so now they've got a few more things than, again, some words that some of you just haven't got a clue about. Let's start with paraphilia, in which a per person either has acted on intense sexual urges towards children or experiences recurrent sexual urges towards children and fantasizes about children Okay, paraphilia, term coined by William Stenkel in 1920, popularized by John Money in the 1960s. Psychologists and psychiatrists codified paraphilias as disorders in the 1980s. Now, paraphilia is the group, the psychological group in which things like pedophiles fit. So do pederasts and the rest of the bestiality, sickle pigs, okay? So let's go a little deeper into this. You know where it starts from a big group and it moves down. Sexual fetishism, response cycle, sex toys. Yeah, okay, wiki, later. Never been much on that place for anything that's worthwhile looking into. Let's try the freedictionary.com. Now, the freedictionary.com pedophile. An adult who is sexually attracted to a child or minor. Did you hear that? Doesn't have to rape them, doesn't have to molest them, doesn't have to give them his precious pedophile love. Attracted to a child or children. Let's see. Let's check out a couple other things here. What do we got? Oh, the thesaurus for it. Pedophile. Degenerate. Deviant. Pervert, those all have about the same description. That would be a person whose behavior deviates from what is acceptably, acceptable, especially in sexual situations with children. Let's see what else we have here. Oh, mind disorders, pedophilia definition, causes and symptoms. Pedophilia is a paraphilia that involves an abnormal interest in children. A paraphilia is a disorder that is characterized by recurrent intense sexual urges and sexually arousing fantasies, generally involving non-human objects, the suffering or humiliation of oneself or one's partner, not merely simulated, or animals, children, or other non-consenting persons. Pedophilia is also a psychological, well, they actually consider it a psychosexual disorder in which the fantasy or actual act of engaging in sexual activity with prepubertal children is the preferred or exclusive means of achieving sexual excitement and gratification. It may be directed toward children of the same sex or, or children of the other sex. 
Some pedophiles are attracted to both boys and girls. Some are attracted only to children, while others are attracted to adults as well as children. Well, we won't get into what causes this. A few people drop their kids on their head really, really hard would be one of the issues, I think. Let's see. Oh, okay. The Merriam-Webster at merriam-webster.com. Pedophile definition. This is a dictionary for those of you who have never opened a book. A dictionary gives you definitions. Pedophile, one affected with pedophilia. Pedophilia, sexual perversion in which children are the preferred sexual object. Let's learn some more about pedophilia, shall we? Psychosexual disorder in which an adult's arousal and sexual gratification occur primarily through sexual contact with prepubescent children. A typical pedophile is unable to find satisfaction in an adult sexual relationship and may have low self-esteem. Seeing sexual activity with a child is less threatening than with an adult. Most pedophiles are men. The condition is extremely rare in women. But don't worry. Those sickle bitches out there are picking up the pace. Never let it be said that pedophile women aren't just as sick and competitive as pedophile men. Oh, and then in our world, ooh, five tips to a flat stomach. I don't think that really matters. Let's see. Audio English Net. Audio English dot net. Pedophile. Noun. An adult sexually attracted to children. And that's about all they have to say on it. You'll notice that sexually attracted is what's used here most often. Not oh, sexually involved. As in, you do not actually have to have the act of intercourse with a child to be a pedophile. Let's try and find something medical. Ah, psychologytoday.com. Let's see what they have to say. The definition. Pedophilia is a paraphilia, an abnormal or unnatural attraction. Pedophilia is defined as the fantasy or act. Did you hear that? Defined as the fantasy or act. There's a difference of sexual activity with prepubescent children. Pedophiles are usually men, can be attracted to either or both sexes. How well they relate to adults of the opposite sex varies. Perpetrators often delude themselves into viewing their actions as helpful to children. They might tell themselves they are contributing to a child's development or that the child is enjoying the act. However, they do tell their victims not to alert their parents or authorities. Well, if it's so freaking good, pedophile, why is it you don't want to get caught? And if you truly believe that what you're doing is right, why don't you have the courage or the balls to stand up for it and say, hey, I rape kids, it should be right, right? No, you don't say that because you're cowards, you're bullies, you're child molesting pieces of pedophile scum. Do us all a favor, go right now, jump in your very full bathtub, put your head under and keep it under. An estimated 20% of American children have been sexually molested. Now, that's an estimated 20% of children. And that goes on being reported. So if you take the number of reports that have created that estimate, and you know that for every one person that has been molested by anyone, there's at least another 5 to 50 in the background that did not have the courage to come forward or did not have the fortune of someone discovering what was happening to them. 20%? Way low. 